Attention, attention, les menus au sessoir. Escargot, loup service, tu n'as pas peur. Oh, les macarelles. Maintenant. Oh, oh. excusez-moi. The things I do for that girl. Over the wall, under the gutter, into the window. Now, finally, some place that's safe. People should come watch this show because because there are there are chefs. Also, you know, there's there's mermaids and magic and and that sort of thing. So yeah, it's 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 gonna be fun. Le so le poisson ou la la il c'est bonjour toi friends from the sea. Fish filet, fish pâté, fish flambel, fish tartare. It's a fish, are you say, Jamori? Green bass, keep on spit, fish kebabs, tuna melt. If it's gill, it's finger you to a tea. Fish lightly toasted and frosted and steamed. Toasted in the blender and tenderly creamed. Dish after dish, like you'd wish to have creamed. Zutalo, I have missed one. For the past three months, these children have done an amazing job putting everything together, all they've learned before. There are many of these students, they had no theater experience, and um, they were willing to make the sacrifice. They've been here for hours after school, and they've put everything they have into this performance. Presenting the court composer, Horatio Bellonis Ignatius Christosius Sebastian. <laughs> Oh, sire, you're gonna love this number. I wrote it for my star pupil. And who might that be? Your youngest. Oh, such a voice, that child. Notes as clear as ice, pitch as pure as water. Why, I haven't heard such a magnificent sound since the Queen. May she rest in peace. You're gonna be so proud. If only that girl would show up for rehearsals once in a while. Well, what are we waiting for? Let the festivities begin! I'm talking about Ariel, that's who. She's acting a little bit fishy lately. Yeah. She's dizzy and she's dreamy, her head's up in the foam, her eyes have gone all gleamy, it's like there's no one home. She floats away the days, moping on the coastal shelf. I've always loved singing and this is actually my first year like having the chance to be able to show off my musical talent, so I'm very happy to be in a show where like I can be who I am and yeah, I'm really excited about the opportunities that this musical has given me and like the rest of the cast who I know haven't sang before but now they get to and like we get to hear their beautiful voices. Look I think she's even wearing brand new shells. She's in love. She's in love. Pounding hearts. Lori B. Got to be. She's in love. Oh, sorceress of the sea, oh, beauty of the brine, hail to the sea witch, hail to Ursula. Floods of my pit, come to me, my darling. Mama's feeling woe-begone, banished to the nether regions of the sea. No food, hardly any company. I'm simply wasting away. Poor Ursula. Yes, poor me. Now what news do you have? King Triton and the Merfolk are celebrating your defeat. And he blames you for the Queen's demise. People should come watch our show because we have all been here working really hard for months. And um, a lot of people, this is like, like they were saying, like some of their first experiences in this. And like every person here has worked so, so hard um, to make this musical come together. And we're all, everybody here in our cast is so talented and we have an amazing cast and crew and you should come see it because it's gonna be really good. Hmm. Apparently, Ariel takes a gift for granted, just like her mother did. <laughs> a woman doesn't know how precious her voice is until she's been silenced. 
It's a story about a sea witch who is misunderstood and just wants to take the power which she truly deserves. And then just like she like wants to get back because her brother cast her out and she just happened to kill his wife. Like it was a mistake. She doesn't think so, but uh, it's just luck happens to be where a redhead just happens to want to grow feet. So she helps and then they don't pay what they need to and then she just gets to try in and then that's what it's about. Pathetic, poor, unfortunate souls in pain, in need. Because they've worked so hard for it, they're looking forward to presenting one of the biggest productions of the year. And so it would be amazing if you came out and supported them because they are super talented. They come flocking to my cauldron crying spells us, please. And do I help them? Yes, I do. Now it's happened once or twice. Someone couldn't pay the price. And I'm afraid I had to rake them across the kills. Yes, I've had the odd complaint. But on the whole, I've been a saint. To those poor, unfortunate souls.